Hello, you beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play Atlas Fallen. I wanted to say Uncharted, and that would have been weird, right? No, we go on with Atlas Fallen, obviously. And we are gonna try, important thing, we are gonna try a side quest. I do not know how that is gonna work out how this is gonna be but my aim is actually to through the quest get a little bit of money and through that get the next armor level upgrade um, that's the plan we could even try well that's actually something I oh we need to go to the right something I do wanna try out in the off first oh boy I did not want to do that. Hello, good. Yep, I totally was surprised by that, if I'm utterly honest. And I sh I, what I should do too, actually, is maybe sell some stuff. What do I mean with sell some stuff? Obviously, I do. Uh, I am talking about the Mata effects. I think I can sell them and I haven't done that yet, which would have helped out with them upgrades already. Tinsy little bit, I think. There, I see. <laughs> All right, and there we have the money for the upgrade. All right, but first things first, we do want to free a priest which we shall do or where we will which with, wh with what we will actually start before upgrading the armor unless we are going to notice well that's not going to be a fight we might pick or not pick then obviously i might be changing my mind and return and um upgrade first so let's see Now, for that, I do not know. Did 
There's still a piece on him. Which I obviously am having problems to see. Bloody hell, on the other side it is, I think. It's a little bit annoying. Oh boy, there we are. Good. I mean, 1400. It's obviously a lot, right? That's a nice armor. Oh, I would like to have that. What is your business here? This should be obvious. Forgive me. You may pass. I am here to see the prisoner. The heretic is in his cell in the back. What is this place? You should know that this is the priest residence. But you remember Armath, who takes care of the small graveyard in the back? These are trying times. Mm -hmm. I was just wandering around. Goodbye. That must be the imprisoned priest. How many years has it been, mentor mine? Me, out here. You, down there. Have you ever reconsidered your insolence? Your heresy? I wonder. I will be gone soon. At least the Morath you knew will be gone. I hear the voice of Thelos ever stronger these past few days. I am... Forgetting names, places. I am afraid, but no matter. If I am to be Thelos's vessel upon Atlas, then I welcome it. That sweet oblivion. Remember me as I was, my teacher. And when you see the error of your ways, tell your students of me. The true hand. Thelos. I read you were imprisoned years ago, all for failing your quest. That is what went down in history. Well, I could have made Morath a different man. How so? I was his mentor. And I failed, obviously. I can tell you more. If you find the key to get me out, Armath must have it. Another guard, Bethrag, vanished recently. I don't know what happened. Okay, thank you for the money. We have upgrades in mind. Welcome. May the light shine your way. Please enter. Could you give me the key to the cell? Take it. Will the heathen finally be punished? In a way. Uh, that was actually too easy, right? Great Before we watcher free in the sky, keeper of the essence. Morath will make a fine priest one day, if we can curb his more sadistic tendencies. Discipline is needed in the shepherd of the masses, but there are limits. We will send him out of the city. A posting. Small, but not unimportant. An essence caravan. Yes. The unnamed will test his tolerance. And if he oversteps, well, what's one more dead slave? Yeah, what is one more dead slave, right? Hey, hey it's me! From the camp. The, uh, thief. You? What have you gotten yourself into this time? They say I killed Joffrey, but he was my best friend. I would never. I'm a thief, not a killer. They framed me. They put fake evidence in my pockets when I was asleep. They wanted to get back at Joffrey for blasphemy. But you can help. Oh, you always get into the strangest situations. Here, take this. I stole the evidence when they were not looking. Wait, this is... Ugh, bloody. Yes, I'm not even sure it's Joffrey's. If you can make it disappear, Bury it somewhere. Oh, I swear this is the last time I'm helping you. 
I truly owe you, my friend. What exactly happened to Joffrey? He was drunk and started a fight with priests. The poor fool. You said I should bury it. Any idea? Try right outside the prison. The priests will never look this close. I'll be going. All right, let's do that. That's, by the way, a weird prison with just four cells. Or let it be six, not many. That's what I wanted to say there. A little bit to the right. Let's never speak of this again. Why? Are you feeling guilty? No. I can sense you are. Just a bit. A no is a no, right? I trust you got rid of the... you know? Yes. Great. One day I'll make it up to you. I swear it on my name. You never mentioned you had a name. Well, I wasn't born unnamed. I am Norris, and you can count me as a friend. Good, let's see, maybe... This is sometimes cool, in some games this has then... You know, something happens. Story quest sidely, si sidewise, but anyways, let's see. I've got the key. Am I free? After all these years. Thank you. Very well. I will tell you what happened. Years ago, I was teaching the young ones. Morath, a boy back then, was in training as a guard. The teachings of Thelos fell on fertile ground with him, and soon turned into blind devotion. I broke with the oppressive ways of the Enlightened. Imprisoning me was their revenge. Young Morath would have needed a critical voice, but he was left with all his rage and self-sacrifice. I still believe Morath can be brought to reason, but I may see things too simple here. Yeah. The Enlightened and Thelos have put a blindfold on everyone. I will tear it off. Alright, cosmetic item acquired. Let us open the inventory, by the way, and see. Go here. Just want to see two things. A. How does this. Okay, that doesn't look good. Oh, ew! No, sorry, but no. We stay with the ugly helmet we have already on. Alright, now, nah, nah, nah. so, for the last remaining minutes, we at least are gonna head back to the city and then do the main quest Thelos, in everlasting blaze. the quest in the next episode. Although, I am intrigued, actually. We still have a side quest open with the beast I was unable to beat to... Or three episodes ago. I wonder if I should... Uh, am I going right, first of all? If I am gonna pay it another wizard. We need to go to... The... Or to A. Ah, boy. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh boy. 
Oh boy, I am calm. I am very calm. That would have been one more hit. Anyways, I couldn't. I wasn't able to do it before. So be it. Happens, right? And that, you guys, brings us right now to the end of today's episode. And you know it. I, as usual, really, really thank you for watching. If you guys actually do have enjoy, we will try it. In the next episode, we try it. One more try, one more try, we do it, we try it. It is beatable. Alright, there it is. Nice. Guys, that then brings us right now to the end of today's episode. And you know it, I, as usual, really, really thank you for one watching. If I guys actually... One of the chains that holds the sundial, a symbol of Thelos's power. Not just a symbol of their power, a manifestation. If you guys actually do have enjoyed today's episode, then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe and hopefully and hopefully I see you in the next episode. Until then I wish you all a wonderful day. Stay frosty. Bye. You have what you need to get into Lethesta. So let us go there. The priests are as hollow as their sermons. As if the light of Thelos would ever bless them. They only yearn for the essence. They need hope, something to give purpose to their lives, even if their devotion is not mirrored. Perhaps an enlightened feels as lost as an unnamed and clings to whatever is available. I might agree.